you know, a lot of you are probably wondering what you're looking at right now. And yes, that is exactly what you are looking at. That is a video of what it says up top. This is actually a picture. There was a video that was released not too long ago and it was taken down within 24 hours. People were able to screenshot it and download the video. However, whenever they're able to upload it back onto the internet, it's always taken down as soon as possible. So the screenshots we were able to keep before it was taken down were these. And the video I myself and a couple others have seen, it is this uh, sick pervert right here whipping this girl right here. And the background, it seems to look like it's in some kind of tropical area or you know, I wish I had a better photo. However, this one, you can't see much of it, but this is just a close up of, yes, exactly what you think it is. And um, I'm sending this video out just to let people know that I'm not attacking one person and I'm not going after one. Just so you can have a better understanding that what we are going through right now is not a coincidence. It was planned. It was rigged. And slowly by slowly, our lives are being taken from us by these people right here, as you see in this video. And we need to stand up, stop hiding behind a fucking screen. And when shit has to hits the fan, you cannot crack. You have to be prepared. Express your Second Amendment by arming yourself and having your family arm yourself. Because if people like these are running this country or even this world, you can't just blame it on this one person because he's involved with many other people. So many other people all around the world. And everyone just wants to point finger at one person at these times right now or the other. And it's not. It's so many people around the world involved in this kind of sick stuff right here. You know, a lot of you will say this is Photoshop, this is doctored, and this wasn't recently. This was years ago. And this is just coming to the light like everything else right now for anybody who was actually seeking information by searching themselves and not going onto certain platforms that censor everybody. And anybody who release this kind of what they say, quote, quotes, uh, confidential information. You, know, you can't censor people that do that because then that just means they're hiding in the dark and they're hiding this evil kind of crap in the dark. These are the people that you are allowing to take your rights, strip your stuff. I'm not a fucking conservative. I'm not a Republican. And I do not take any sides. From the beginning of everything, I've always been in the middle and decided for myself. And the way I did that was speaking to certain people who educated themselves on both matters of the parties and reality of what was happening in our world. So I always listened to both. I never chose sides and I never supported one or other side and I never backed up any other side. I always stayed in the middle and had my own thoughts and put everything to myself together. This is not surprising to me, but how this is actually being released now is more surprising because people are finding many ways to get this out and are trying so hard because they know the censorship is actually real. It will happen. And if anybody saw this, it would demolish a very powerful set of group of people who run this world or who are part of the people who are running this world at the moment of everything we are going through and have been going through. These are part of the people. And this is only one, but this is clear proof right here. And for anybody who can't see this or does not want to believe it, I understand it. You cannot believe it because you just don't, you're out of touch with this kind of stuff and you hear it, but you just don't want to believe it, but you have to believe it because this makes you Take better precautions of what you do every day and how you decide to live for the rest of your life and also what you leave behind, the life you leave behind. Take action, stand your ground, we the people, and it's not just America or just only, no, it's everybody. Remember, this country is diverse. We have everybody here from all around the world. They came here for a purpose and we didn't give a crap about the politicians or what these sick people did here until it affected us because we could not stop it. 
But the proof that's coming out, we can stop it. There's more than a reason right there to stop anything that's happening after what you are seeing here and what we have been seeing. More people need to stand up and speak about it and stop pointing fingers as far as the left and the right. It's neither one of those motherfuckers. Excuse my language, but it's neither one of those. That's just called division. It's the set of people who are controlling everything that the world is going through. It is very dangerous. Start taking it more serious, especially if you have offspring, even if you don't have offspring and you just value life in general. Take it serious. Because it's not happening to you doesn't mean it's not real or it's not going to happen. Just know that this stuff is real and it has been happening for so many years. And how it's been constantly covered and put under the dark is what's frightening. And we've seen people disappear for releasing information out like this. Be careful. Be aware. Until next time.